Welcome to another JavaScript for you. This morning we're going to go through something very basic and that's a little bit about the syntax of JavaScript. I want to explain the semicolon at the end of this line for instance. In JavaScript a semicolon is a separator not a terminator which means it's not required. If you have just a one line JavaScript program like this and it's just a little script there I don't even need it. The end of line will indicate to the JavaScript parser that that's it, that's all there is to do. It's considered good form to put it there because it's more explicit, but it's not absolutely required. Another thing I should go through is a JavaScript block. And that's not a block in a Smalltalk sense if you're familiar with Smalltalk blocks, but if I want to group code together, I put these curly braces around them and that will give me a JavaScript block. The way you would normally see these is to group meth. Um, the way you would normally see this is to group a bunch of JavaScript statements into a function or into a condition. So if I had an if then else kind of setup, I would have the if clause in its own block and the else clause in its own block, for instance. And I'll get into the syntax for those in a little bit. But those are the two basics that I wanted to get out of the way before we advanced on to that. So that's about it for today. Until next time, have fun with JavaScript.